I'm Dr. Sudhir Nadimpalli. I'm a pulmonologist uh, practicing at Virinchi Hospital, Hyderabad. So, what is water in the lungs and how does it form? See, the lung has the lung parenchyma, which is the proper lung, and there are two layers surrounding the lungs, which are called the pleura. So, the lungs themselves can be filled with water when the heart is involved sometimes. So, we call them, we call it cardiogenic pulmonary edema, which means that the lung gets flooded because of the backflow from the heart. So, any heart failure directly affects the lungs and then floods the lungs. So, when the heart fails, the back pressure goes on to the lungs and floods the lungs and then there you have water in the lungs. And then that has to be removed with injections and sometimes we have to put people on ventilators or uh, masks giving excessive oxygen because oxygen is impaired or oxygen is not being given by the lungs at the time. This other lung water is the one which is outside the lungs which is in the layer called pleura which is because of some disease like uh, TB, some, some of the diseases uh, can accumulate water outside the lungs. When lung has an infection like pneumonia there is also this layer which gets infected, the pleura gets infected which forms pus sometimes which can, uh, which has to be drained and it can also accumulate fluid uh, when there is, when in other conditions like uh, lung cancers. So, all these can be treatable, these can be removed by needles or putting drains like tubes in the chest. The lung water from the heart is different and lung water from the pleura are different. Thank you.